What is going on guys? Thank you so much for tuning back in for another video. Today, we're gonna to be talking about some bad news for the WK and XK community. Basically, anyone who has a, a WK or XK or even the Jeep Liberties are gonna be in a lot of trouble because JBA is no longer supporting uh, anything besides essentially their control arms, all of the drop shipping parts that they used to have and their own lift kit mashups. They don't have those anymore. And then they also don't have their four by guard armor. Uh, they're not making any more of that stuff. Essentially, if you go on their site, everything just says sold out and they are, they're not making any more of it. They're just cleaning out their inventory and then it'll say out of order. So that is some really bad news because JBA makes some incredible parts, but they also put parts together to make kits that make it extremely easy to help you uh, lift your Jeep, which anyone who has a WK or XK knows how difficult it is to find parts, find part numbers. Uh, just to try to set everything up to actually get your Jeep lifted and not have any issues. Everyone knows how extremely difficult that can be and JBA really went out of their way to make a big difference in making it much easier for us to do that. So with that being said, they are also essentially shifting all their focus on tooling and engineering their upper control arms, which I actually run on my Jeep. Uh, they make them for a select number of like Dodge, Jeeps, Toyotas, but the idea is that they, they said in their latest email, I'll put it up on the screen right here for you. Uh, they basically said that they wanna spend more time focusing on what they do that makes them original. And that would be specifically their control arms and not so much concerned with their off-road armor, which I know is taking a lot of time away from their technicians. They are a relatively small company in Pennsylvania, so they don't have like tons and tons of workforce to constantly be welding and cutting all that stuff. And the uh, upper control arm technology that they have is essentially designed and engineered by them so that's really like their most unique asset that they have but that is some really unfortunate news to hear uh, like I said I do run a set of their upper control arms I run the, uh, the upper control arms for lifted Jeeps and then I also run the 4x guard armor or 4x armor I believe is what it is I run their uh, belly skid plate pan I don't have it on the Jeep right now at the moment, I'm actually gonna be doing another video covering a one year review because I've actually had it on for, I think just about 365 days. I got it last August. So I'll be covering how well it's held up, uh, my experience and thoughts on that. So definitely stay tuned to check out that video. But I thought I would just bring you guys some more information on JBA because it really is such a big hit to the WK and XK community. What we decided to do is to work with the same drop shippers that JBA Off-Road used to work with. So we now sell almost all of the same parts that they used to sell for the Jeep Grand Cherokees and the XKs, which also includes our own 4-inch lift kit. Uh, we have all the shocks and strut combinations that they used to have. We have uh, front drive shaft rebuild kits, and we even have the clevis bolt, the infamous clevis bolt between the lower control arm and the strut when those need to get replaced. So we hope you guys will check out our website down in the link below. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll catch you guys in the next video.